Hey, hey, you. Yeah, with the horns. Come here. Just a little bit closer. Closer. Closer, closer, closer. Ah! Again! Ah! <laughs> One Chicago, two Chicago, three Chicago, four. Five Chicago, six Chicago, seven Chicago, more! <laughs> more and more and more! Dad? Ow! Dad? Ow! Dad? Ow! Dad? Ow! Idiot, those are clones! Why do you think I ordered all that corn syrup? It was for pancakes. Like the single stick that easily broke. Broke. Oh man. Broken. I am much stronger when there's a whole bundle of me. <laughs> Jungle for animals, not bad doctors. How about bad, bad doctors? doctors. Possibly defeat all these clones. <gasps> George, just tell all the animals how delicious they are. Entire jungle should say, Thank you, George. But Ape think a plan. <laughs> say thank you, Ape, instead. George, 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 George. <laughs> Must be nice. <laughs> anyone? Anyone? Fine. I've still got space for dessert. You're going to get eaten eventually, so you might as well. <gasps> it can't be. It's gonna banana. Come on! Get out! It's mine! Maybe if I wiggle it... Let me get this straight. That's a magic banana, and only the chosen hero can pull it from the stone? Uh-huh. George read all about Excalibanana when he little, George. But I want it! I need it! You found it, Ape. Maybe you should... Why are you talking to that filthy coat human woman with bad shorts? Oh, hello. Have we met? It's me, Ape. I'm George's mentor. George! Our hero who solves every problem by himself. Pull Excalibanana from the stone, George! Hey. Yeah. Ursula get magic banana, then Ursula eat magic banana. <laughs> Next! Maybe no one deserves Excalibur banana. All I know is I'm starving. Ow! What's wrong with this? You've never seen a... Oh, my word, I have Excalibur Banana! The Chosen One! Me? Oh, no. There must be a mistake. I'm not a hero. I'm George's mentor. Here. Whoa. Excalibur Banana choose ape. But I don't even know what it does. <laughs> See? Ape, perfect choice. So it seems to let me fly. That's not... Oh! Excalibur banana also make you super tough! And super strong! And super not careful enough. I'm not used to being a hero. That okay. George, help! First tip, all hero need sweet cape. You don't wear a cape. George's cape invisible. Second tip, need to be hero all the time. Great power mean no days off. I'm sure I could manage that. It harder than it look. 
Monsters down there or nothing. This defies all known sciences. Biology, geology, physics, quantum physics. Yeah, yeah because it's magic, of course. Don't you know anything about wizard swords from magic history? Anyone who possesses Excalibur Banana becomes super fantastic! Anyone? Yep, anyone. That's what I said. Anyone. Anyone at all. Mm-hmm. <gasps> Even you! Yes, thank you. Thank you. Very flattered indeed. All this heroing is exhausting. George, what are you doing? Yeah. Oh, George always wanted to garden, and now with new Hero Ape doing hero stuff, George have time. But why inside? So it no get wet or sunburnt. Ah, I see. Well, maybe I'll help. It's been a long day, and I could use some relaxing. <sighs> but I just got home. Oh, sorry. You're a full-time job, remember? Yes, of course. will make you grow big and strong. Strange chemicals George find help too. And so, Ape rescued people, animals, and even vegetables in need. Signed autographs until his pen ran dry. Sliced, diced, and chopped. Fought that weird monster guy again and did it over and over and over. I never knew being a hero was so exhausting. Safe and sound while I take a nap. Everyone can wait. <sighs> wakey, wakey! Someone just made a big mistake. Haven't you heard? I'm incredible now! Ow, 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 ow. How are you doing that? <laughs> What, this? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because I have Excalibur banana? But I put it back in the stone. No, you put it in the fake stone I made out of food coloring and corn syrup. The real one's over there. You're going to hurt me now, aren't you? No, no, no. Not yet. Now I'm going to hurt you. Flaunting the laws of physics now! George! George! You have to help me! One second, ape! Good name tougher than George thought! What seemed to be problem, ape? I have Excala Banana! It okay. Tell George. This magic sword that I have is really awesome! A blues wallet? Keys? I lost Excalibur banana! All I wanted was a nap! Oh, there, there. <laughs> you didn't hear all hard. It is. It really is. But now Ape must get sword back before Doctor does more bad things. But how? He's super-powered. He'll beat the stuffing out of me. Eh. That hero part. But no worry, Ape's smart, remember? And George helped too. Oh, okay, smart plan. That's what I do, right? Ah! Bad cucumber! Bad cucumber! <laughs> and don't come back! <laughs> um, stop. Stop, please? Or what? Your 
You're just a dirty fur coat. You don't even have powers anymore. <laughs> You can't win! Why would you even try to fight me? Because that's what heroes do. And because I had to give George enough time to do that. What? No! 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 Good work, Abe. See? That what being a hero all about. Abe doesn't even need magic banana sword. Thanks, George. George, George, George. At least I can finally go home and rest. <laughs> Behold the jungle scientist, focused in her pursuit of knowledge. Patient in her quest for understanding. Come on! I've seen faster glaciers! Sorry, sorry. Master of jungle camouflage. The purple paisley panther, never before seen by humans. Stop! My cornea! <gasps> no, no, no! Come back! <laughs> Must do science research. Must win Nobel Prize. And the Nobel Prize goes to Not Magnolia. I'm a complete science failure. Wait, there is another award. Huh? The absolutely will never win a Nobel Prize award goes to Magnolia. <laughs> Even insects think I'm hilarious. We are not insects. We are crunch bugs. Are you an invertebrate? Well, do you have six legs? I, I, uh, Insect. Listen, it doesn't matter. Now, please, extend your tongue so Queen Crunchetta can welcome you with her sacred taste bud tango. Extend my... Uh, uh. Hey, don't you eat? Magic sauce. Uh, uh. Oops! You ate our queen! <laughs> no, I didn't. Do you have any more? Ow! This isn't funny, you monster! Queen Crunchetta was our one and only beloved sovereign! So you don't have any more. Look, buddy, if I was a crazy delicious bug, I wouldn't go around dancing on other people's tongues. You're doing it again! Sorry, sorry. You know you guys are better than peanuts, right? I'll go now. Hey! Oh, mama! <sighs> Nothing like a full belly to make you forget your troubles. Oh, right, I'm a failure. Great. Now I'm gonna get leeches in my underwear again. Or worse, I'm Chow. Unless I throw my binoculars against that rock, which will tip and fall on that log, which will arc the honey badger into that crocodile's mouth, and it'll make him cry, and his friends will leave because they're so embarrassed, and all the noise will wake up that hippo. <laughs> than before, but how? Hey, what's up there? It's obvious from the monkey's tail movements and the tiger's wedding ring that they're a couple, which means a brand new species that I've already written up in an award-winning paper? I'm a genius! It's science time! And the answer to the meaning of life and everything is 42. Finally, the 
cure for lizard wart fever. There you go, buddy. Magnolia! George, make fruit platter in jungle cooking class. Magnolia, try? Huh? This looks just like a... Oh my gosh! I know what happened to my smarts! Uh, bye! Is that supposed to be me? Maybe... Queen Grunchetta was beloved by all, and we will never forget. Make me smart! Make me smart! You again! Get out of here! Sorry! Sorry! Just gonna take a few more of you for the road. <laughs> and therefore, I think you'll see that wood magnets are a perfect... Um... A perfect... Oh, yeah. That's the brain juice. <laughs> brain juice? I wasn't eating hundreds of defenseless jungle creatures or anything. <laughs> George here, Minnie, screaming. It's uh, lemurs uh, out there somewhere. They always scream really quietly when they're in trouble. That's it, screaming lemurs! <sighs> you might fool George, but I know what a screaming lemur sounds like, and is not it. Um... Ah! Hey! Lemurs mad at George for waking them up! <laughs> Hundreds of defenseless jungle creatures? Magnolia, you know we all care about you. Ursula not care. But first, Magnolia must admit she have problem. There's no problem. I'm a science genius. That first problem. And this is the second. <gasps> it's worth it for the smarts. You turn into crunch bug! Cool! No, not cool! Ugh. Magnolia, you have to stop eating crunch bugs, no matter how smart they make you! I tried that, but I keep changing! Ah! Yeah. Oh! I promise I'll change! I'll never eat another crunch bug again! Here is time. Let the crunch bug cleanse and ceremony begin! Um, before we do this, can I have one last bite? No! How about just half a bite? No! A nibble? What did I just say? Okay, fine! Sheesh! Sorry! <laughs> hey! I didn't know you guys made silk! Wow! You guys are really cocooning me up here! This is gonna fix all the bug stuff, right? Right? The cleansing ceremony is complete! Uh, uh, great! I'm cured! Yes, cured of your non-crunch bugness. Say what? All hail Queen Magnolia, our new crunch bug queen! Queen Magnolia, Queen Magnolia! You? What did you do? Well, I think it's pretty obvious and uh, only foul since you ate our old queen. Uh, I've got six legs and a thorax. Turn me back. Turn me back. Well, I'm sorry. I only know the turn you into a bug ceremony. Now, let's get to laying those eggs. <laughs> George, you gotta help me! <laughs> Stop! Stop it! It's me, Magnolia! Hey, you new Crunch Bug Queen! Congrats! But I don't want to be Crunch Bug Queen! <gasps> but there hasn't been a Crunch Bug abdication since all six! Just know, I'm doing it for love. 
I don't care. I'm a giant bug. Hmm. Point taken. And then there's the millions of eggs you'll have to lay. I don't want to be Crunch Bug Queen. I don't want to be Crunch Bug Queen. I'm a scientist, so maybe I should start acting like one. With or without Crunch Bugs. My witness, I will never eat crunch bugs again! Come back to the nest, Queen Magnolia! Your crunch bugs need you! <laughs> and <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Apologize to Tasty Bugs first. They turned me into this! You ate a thousand of us! Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'll never do it again. After all, I made this cure all on my own. See? Ta-da! God, shark farts. Next time I give up crunch buns after I make the cure. Oh, oh, disgusting. We are out. Our new queen. <laughs> sure. Magnolia makes great slug queen. 